The 80 to 20 rule in intersexual dynamics. If we were to consider each sexual intercourse as a separate unit, we would find that in the dating sphere, marital relationships or cohabitation do not count here. The overwhelming majority of young women, about 80%, are happy with a small minority of men, 20%. They are alpha males who are wanted by women, and therefore successful, and thus circulate from one to another, while beta males rarely get to speak. The latest sociological surveys of the frequency of sexual intercourse in the developed world say the opposite of what has been the mantra since time immemorial men are fucking everywhere, while women sit chastely at home. It looks like the opposite is true. But how can that be possible? With whom do women have more sexual relations if not with men? The explanation lies in the fact that most men are beta and they just watch silently as their alpha, companions switch one woman after another. There is a rule of thumb where the typical female will rather share an alpha male with another female than have a beta male all to herself. However, there is no need to worry about the numbers themselves. Whether it is 5 or 10 percent more or less is not important. It is a matter of principle. What do you think about it?